Yeah. Air guitar. You see that, bro? It's nice. It's That's nice. pretty awesome. Yeah. Jill, I just did the air guitar. <laughs> In a captain's yeah. hat. In a captain's hat. I'm wearing a captain's hat right yeah. now. Yeah, we'll have to send you a picture. Yeah, it's pretty. We should be doing this via Google Hangouts so we can see all this. That's true. That is true. But we don't subscribe to Google. No? Oh. No, we do Zoom. Yeah, we do Zoom. Yeah. Yeah. I bet, I'm, you know, speaking of, with all this stuff going on, I bet Zoom, Google Hangout, Citrix, and GoToMeeting, and all those Webex, folks are, yeah. WebEx, yeah, they're all, have a, quite, a, quite a load on their servers. <laughs> I bet. Everybody's calling in. I tried, to, I tried to call in to a conference call the other morning, and all circuits were busy, Ooh. and in the, my distant memory, I could hear that busy signal that I haven't heard in many, many years. It okay. wasn't really there, but I could hear it. You, know, uh-huh. you could. Because it's tucked across the screen. Well, it's tucked way back in your busy. mind from uh, back in back uh, in the day. Uh, 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 yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> People don't know what that sounds like anymore. You know, we have yeah. like, you know. We, we, have have gener- we have a few generations behind us that yeah. don't know that. <laughs> yeah. That sound. You have like 16 call ratings these days with our devices. Right. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> and merge all the calls. And has anybody, has anybody figured out how many people you can add to a call? I haven't I haven't mm-hmm. tested it. Like no. I, I just know that I've any time that I've tried to continue to add people it worked. <laughs> That's all I know. So I'm I'm I've been up to four. Four? So oh. Five. Five. We yeah. did five yesterday. Really? So it yeah. worked. Yeah, mm-hmm. it's awesome, man. Mm-hmm. I've done up to six, I think. Well, you just have to Oh, I had to, I had to one up. You had to one up I didn't want yeah. you to like think yeah, that you like did you something go, better there you than go. me. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> just keep keeping everybody down while I go up. All right. That's good. Yeah, we should probably introduce the person we're talking to. Yeah, I'm sorry. Uh, we're talking to. I always do that too. I always look to, to Brooke to introduce, but I'll do it this time. Oh, thanks. Yeah. So we are talking with Jill Dabbs, who is the executive director for Downtown Springdale. Spring Alliance. Yay! Yay! I threw the alliance there at the end. I don't know if that alliance, was alliance, yeah. Yeah. Downtown Springdale Alliance. 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 Oh, okay, go. I was right. I was right. Well, uh, once again. DSA. I've one up Jill once once again. Once again. <laughs> yeah, I said alliance and she didn't have that. You're welcome. I think she was saying it as you were saying it. You guys said it at the same time. So Brooke, what are we what are we talking to Jill about today? Um, we're going to talk to Jill about let's talk about the um I have a, uh, the Springdale Chamber Lean Local campaign. I think they just sent yeah. another email out about that. Yeah. But first, yes, before we do it, I can we can we talk about the hat? Can we talk about the captain's hat? I can't take you seriously right now. Why? Because you you're wearing a captain's hat. So this was given to me by one of my favorite employees of all time. <laughs> Actually, he's now my favorite. Wes Ryan on our team okay. ordered this for me. I won't tell you from where because I don't approve of that. Mm-hmm. But ordered this from a e-commerce website. Mm-hmm. Came in and he thought of this on his own and. Uh, Yes. He gave it to me. I know, because you're the you're the captain. You're the captain. You're the captain of the ship. You're the captain of the ship. <laughs> it's captain. All, captain. Captain Eric. We yeah, will have to Eric. send you a picture because it's hilarious. Just call me Captain. Captain. Yeah. Captain. Yep, Captain. <laughs> I'm just gonna leave it at that. It's Captain. <laughs> so yep. anyway, we got that right. out of the way. Yeah, that's no, why I'm is. wearing this hat because right, it was a he gift. Is the captain. Because I'm the captain, and it was a gift. There you go. Makes now everybody good. knows. And this is my it's legitimately my only responsibility now at the company <laughs> is to wear the hat. <laughs> to wear the hat. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just wear the hat. Be quiet. Be quiet. Everything's okay. Yeah. Perfect. There you go. I'll Show, up. Show up. When Show up. Wear is. the hat. Yeah. Perfect. Now, okay. Now we'll go back to Jill. Talk Lean about the Lean Local. local. Yeah. Lean Local. Lean Local. Um, so the downtown, uh, I mean, the Springdale Chamber of Commerce is leading out with a Lean Local campaign. And on their website, you can uh, share your local lean story. And then what we're doing is we're taking those stories and sharing them out um, so that people can um, know what local services, curbside food pickup, oh. online retail shopping, delivery services, and many other ways that local businesses are innovating in order to um, support the community through this crisis that we're oh. in and also showing us as a community how we can support these very, very, very important locally owned businesses because they are the backbone of our economic interest. Man, that is one of the most awesome things I've heard in a long time. I know. Jill. Honestly, that's, that's really cool. So, how, how, so how, there's how, a lot of. Okay, go ahead. No, no, no. You go ahead. I'm sorry. I was just saying there's a lot of different organizations that are doing different things like this, and we are just we're looking for all the different ways and all the different resources that are out there available 
um, for the local businesses and specifically in downtown Springdale because that's what the downtown Springdale lot focuses on. Of course, we want all local businesses in all of our communities to um, do well throughout this. So how does this work? Like, I mean, what, what's the, I guess, what's the first step here? Are, is the chamber and the DSA? The website? Are, y- I'm, I'm, are y'all trying to, well, actually, hold on, Brooke. Yeah. Okay, I was trying to ask a question, and I wasn't done, and you ruined it. I did. I, for I, everyone, I interrupted you. For I everyone. interrupted the captain, so <laughs> my bad. <laughs> interrupted the captain. Bad mistake, my number bad. one. Mm-hmm. Uh, so does... What's the first act? Are y'all, are, are y'all all trying to like collect the businesses and like get them to participate first and then you announce to the public or how's this working? Yes. We are reaching out to the businesses and just asking them, what, what are you doing? Let, and then let us be your voice and your platform to the masses. Each business has their own social media outlet and they have certain people that follow them. But then as you spread out to the Downtown Springdale Alliance social media, the uh, Springdale Chamber of Commerce social media, Leisure List social media, we have a we can reach a much broader audience for these local businesses, and we are doing that in any way that we can to help support these local businesses. So you mentioned something about like delivery and stuff like that. I mean, so once you get all these businesses together to under, I guess you're trying to understand their needs, right, or what what innovation and technology they actually have already have in place, right? Right. And then you're going to, therefore, are you going to help them acclimate to some of these, like, deliveries and pickups and things like that and maybe provide them solutions so that consumers that are basically in quarantine, for lack of better terms, are able to then, therefore, know that they have that option to leverage these businesses? Is that, am I going on the right path? Yeah. You are, you are, and one Dang it, I, I thought, I thought for one second, Jill, it. I thought for one second I had a really good idea, but it's actually, <laughs> I thought I was, but, but no, you guys it. already have it. That's awesome, man. It. That is so cool. We're, and it's changing, it's changing by the hour. Yeah. People are, you know, sharing resources, sharing ideas. Um, you know, we're, as humans, we're resilient, and we mm-hmm. solve problems, and we figure things out, and. You know, that's one of the things, that's one of the silver linings that I feel like will come out of this situation is there will be things that, you know, actually make our businesses stronger that's in right. the future when this passes because they will start doing things that they've never done yeah. before and realize this is, you know, this is a positive revenue stream and it serves my customers well. That's, so it'll be real interesting to see those type of things that come out of this. Yeah, awesome. that's really cool. That's awesome. I'm sure that, I'm sure everybody in our local area would, be encouraged and love to hear that. I mean, it's, it's, you know, it's actually a, uh, it is a time to kind of, it's really an acceleration to, to Omnichannel. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Turn this around. Turn this around no, we're not going to turn around us. about us. Okay. No, I'm not going to do that, <laughs> bro. Golly. Tell me more. Tell me more. Tell me yeah. more about the Omnichannel. Omnichannel. I, don't, I need to know more Omnichannel? about that. Interesting. I need to know more. That's Please funny. Tell me. So Omnichannel. we, <laughs> okay, I will, I will, but this is awesome. This is a, this not, cool. not this, that, that is awesome. Yeah. <laughs> It is. It's 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 really cool. That I mean, and it's um, you know, it's like I think it's it's neat. And like it just in Springdale, you know, just just the change from yesterday to today, you know, mm-hmm. just like, I mean, it's 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 just it's crazy times that we're that, that we're living in. Yeah, that that yeah. I mean, but the thing about it is, though, I think that you know, like what Jill and and what everyone's doing, the the chamber and, and the community coming together. I mean, that's what it's all about, right? And, and it's in. in in any kind of circumstances like this, where we're experiencing a, a uh, non-voluntary, an unvol- involuntary change like this, you know, that it does spark community engagement and ideas to innovate and ways for us to continue to stay together and, and work for the greater greater good both in the community. So I, I'm, I'm with you all 100%, Jill. So how would not I as a, in the, in the business sense, but how would I as a consumer get involved? How do I participate? Um, tune in to the Downtown Springdale Alliance Facebook page, social media, the Springdale Chamber of Commerce, um, Leisure List has a lot of good resources that are popping up. And just and reach out to us and, and, um, and look for things that are the businesses. One of the things consumers can do is just think about where you go 
what local businesses do you already support? And look them up and see what are they doing? How can you continue to support them? Share your favorite, um, you know, your favorite local businesses with others and recommend them for the services that are, they are providing during this time. Yeah. Um, so, yeah. You so, know, if you have a favorite, if you have, if you have a bartender or a waitress that serves you on a regular basis, check on them. Um, check on them. And if you have the means to help support them or give them support during this time, that would mean so much to them. Yeah, like a like a virtual tip jar, man. Yeah, a virtual tip jar. Yeah, oh yeah. Uh, one of our bartender friends that has been um, worked worked with us in the past. Uh, we we definitely have been sending her, you know, temporary job opportunities mm-hmm. and things like that. So she's she's uh, she's definitely been out of it for a, a, like a week now. Yeah, yeah, and mm-hmm. you know, and I'm just sitting here thinking too. Like, I mean, is this a a, a situation where, you know, like for example, local taco down the road? Down here, mm-hmm. everybody loves local taco, right? But is this mm-hmm. like they may not have ever offered, you know, a catering or a pickup service or even a delivery service mm-hmm. or anything like that? That where, you know, literally we could still get the food from there. I mean, right. and is is that is that correct, Jill? Is that a, like a practical way that people? Yes. Okay. Yeah, I know yes. Black Apple is doing that. They're uh, really. Yep, yeah, their tap room is closed, but you can still pick up cider. Really? Yeah. Very good. That on the Facebook. Yeah, I think cider awesome. is a good thing to have during. <laughs> it is. All the it is a good thing to have. The back of my bag. <laughs> well, that's awesome. So, the way that, uh, and, and so this is really just about kind of just the typical, you know, social media kind of sprawl and just making sure everybody's aware. And I mean, I think that, you know, and I think the consumer is going to be really happy to hear about this. I mean, really, I mean, because part of, you know, being quarantined is missing your interaction, you know, with the places that you love to go to, you know, even the, the foods and all that kind of stuff. I mean, you know, you're, you're it really disconnects you, but they can still have some sort of connection with that, even in spite of uh, having to be kept inside. Yeah, I'm just excited. Oh, so, oh, go ahead. No, go ahead. Oh, I'm just really excited. excited. I'm excited. excited. I'm, excited. I'm always excited. No, I'm excited to live in a um, community that 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 is doing stuff like. Yeah. You know, I think it's great like that we can all come together and, 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 and help each other out. I agree. No, absolutely. I like that and I also want to mention that, um, you know, we might not think about businesses like um, a bakery, but Jennifer Masabura, Masabura at Shelby Lynn Cake Shop mm-hmm. has put out that they are practicing, you know, they're asking for online orders. Anybody that needs a cake, wants a cake, online orders, and they will, and when you go to pick up your cake, you call them. And they will come out to your car and hand it to you. Ooh, so nice. they're practicing. Nice. You know, a lot of these businesses are thinking, okay, how can we, how can we serve the public in such a way that we keep everybody safe and yeah. um, transmission down? And and you know, they're doing, you know, they're doing things like that. So you can even get a birthday cake if you're stuck at home with all your all your children. <laughs> yeah. No, oh, absolutely. And you want a cake? You, you can get a cake. We should check yeah. in on Yanez uh, across the next next door and mm-hmm. see see how he's doing because yeah I mean I bet I bet his business has been affected by this. Sure, yeah I think everybody's you know kind of ha- you know has already but I mean I like the uh, the idea of you know, quickly what I like about this is the swiftness that you're talking about Jill you know that that the that the chamber and the alliance have, have both reacted and the businesses you know I think that that's you know that's that shows a lot of not only is it about support but also recognizing where we're at how do we make and adapt the changes really quick so that we can kind of carry on and, and, and continue to bolster our economy and, and, and you know basically charge us through this situation this is awesome yeah, it's really it's really really important we come out on the other side of this that we, we supported our local businesses and you know get some food there and, and if they're still there and I, you know, I think we can I think we can absolutely Absolutely, we can. We always have, right? This is, mm-hmm. I mean, mm-hmm. not only is this America, America, but this, America. this is America. this is humankind, man. I mean, this is wow. we've, we've always been resilient. We've always overcome, right? And we always carry on. So this is, uh, you know, this is a really encouraging talk, Jill. I know that uh, I've appreciated it. I know Brooke has, mm-hmm. and I know that our community will too. I really so, appreciate you guys. And tell me more. Okay, I have a question. Okay, go ahead. Uh, so, so, um. 
tuning in to Omni Channel, where no. would I tell uh, viewers on the Downtown Springdale Alliance to go to with the Omni Channel? I don't know. That's a big one. <laughs> yeah. How much? How much time you got, Jill? <laughs> yeah. I know. Omni Channel is a. Uh, it's 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 everywhere. I mean, it's, it's Walmart.com, Amazon.com, anywhere that you can buy things online, um, in store. I mean, it's, it's yeah. everywhere. It is. Omnipresent. Oh, You're blowing your mind. Blowing, <laughs> mind. blowing your mind. It's really Walmart, though. Amazon's not really on the channel. <laughs> uh, sorry, Brooke. I hated to. I'm sorry that you even said yeah, the A word on the show. I did say the A you word. You said the A word. I mean, yeah. And then you made me say the A word by saying, talking about the A word that you said. So, but really, it's Walmart. Mm -hmm. Right? You know, Walmart is the true Omni King player. So, <laughs> maybe it is the truth. But, yeah. you know Whole Foods. Whole Foods. Doesn't matter. <laughs> Just with a W up there. Oh, no, no. <laughs> but, you know, but the reality to it is, is I think that local businesses have an opportunity to, I mean, what the bakery is going to be doing is, is on the channel, right? Uh, I mean, I think mm -hmm. that there's more extensions to, you know, I, I'm really interested to see how we can get delivery going, right? That's even a step further. You know, how do we, you know, uh, do things of that nature, make it even, you know, and as you guys uh, in the Alliance and, and down, I keep saying the Alliance, downtown Springdale Alliance, sorry, the Alliance sounds like it's some sort of, just alliance, yeah. something. But if we did, you know, at the chamber and downtown Spring Alliance, you know, and as you hear back from these businesses, I mean, what's the platform, right? That maybe these local businesses who don't have, I mean, it's gonna be hard to be, you know, to to invest on their end. But is there a way that they could get community of developers to work on kind of an ordering system or platform, or to at least help them integrate or whatever that might be, you know, so that consumers and the public can go in and and transact with them, right? You know, I mean, yep. I think I think now is the time where you know, you know, we could accelerate that, and, and local businesses can kind of you know, get up to speed on just about the convenience that consumers would expect anyway. This just happens to be kind of a forced circumstance to where, <laughs> you know, and, and and you know, I mean, honestly, that there's there is one thing that I think from a marketing standpoint that businesses could kind of turn, you know, the the dial a little bit on understanding what's going on as maybe an, uh, some sort of encouragement. I mean, everybody is at their house, right? Like in marketing, you know, you're always like, even back in the direct mail days, you know, when are people home, right? Yeah. <laughs> you want to hit them like you got to wait till, you know, it's like you got to kind of juggle the, the work hours versus, you know, the second shifts and, the, mm -hmm. you know, the entertainment, you got to hit them right at the right time. And that's what, I mean, everybody's at home right now. I mean, so, and online, and and online, and and yeah, they're watching TV. You know, they're 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 online working. You know, I mean, everybody's virtual, and so that, I mean that that's something that I would encourage. You know, is all to kind of think about too is these local businesses. I mean, if you kind of have a you know, your target is is a little bit more receptive and available as far as just knowing when and where. So. Uh, but anyway, I mean, it'd be kind of neat to see, you know, even the development community come together a little bit on this to help some of the local businesses accelerate that. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, for folks that are looking for for work, maybe there's a way they can plug in to, to provide delivery you know, for these businesses, right? Mm -hmm. So they can deliver goods and things like that. So, interesting, isn't it? Good, yeah. Thank you, Brooke. Yeah. I appreciate that. On the channel. On the channel. On the cat. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Jill. Thank you, Jill. We really appreciate your time today, and we look forward to talking to you soon. There you go. Yeah. Thank you. Stay in touch. We'll be we'll be back. Stay in touch. Thank you. All right. Bye -bye. Take care. Bye.